I guess this would be the same question to, uh, to both of you. Just wondered when when the momentum seemed to shift, were there, was there something that you guys tried to get to, whether defensively or offensively, something to, to try to stem the tide to turn it back? And then and was there a reason you didn't see that work tonight? Um, I mean, kind of went on a run toward the end of the second. Uh, I think we were up 26 and eight cuts, 16. Uh, and went to the half, like two and a half left or something like that. <clears throat> And then that momentum carried to, to the third quarter. You know, we came out, tough shots, some turnovers. Um, and they made us go on the other end, you know, with, with transition. And then, you know, some guys got hot for three. You know, uh, you know, like we say all year, guys going to play their best. Um, Bays, you know, and, and, you know, some other guys who haven't made shots all, all year, you know, from three and eight. You know, I think they was like four for eight, and you know, other guys made shots. But, um, you know, this is a game that we definitely supposed to win, not supposed to lose at all. You know, but we learned from it, and, you know, move forward. Russ, do you have any thoughts on that, just especially in that kind of the second half? And... <clears throat> no, I mean, I drew an AD. We, we had the game with our hands. We lost the game. We still was that. What were your thoughts on, on the ejection? Um, it is what it is. You know, I don't feel like I got the first take, honestly. The first one was the tech. The uh, last one was a tech that's cool, bro. Um, just how I play the game, and you know, I'm more old school. Um, and when shit like that happened, I don't let it slide. So, you know, I take it on the chin and move on, but you know. In game of basketball, certain things you just don't do. Like in baseball, you don't look bad. And certain things you just don't do in certain in sports. Um, game already over. Um, and I didn't like it. So was that? BT? For both of you guys, have been in the league for quite a while. How do you process losing the game like this up by 26? You know, you just let it go, move on to the next one, or you think it over about what you could have done better? I want to early in the season, so, you know, we don't want to go on it too much. Um, there's really not much to be said, to be honest. You know, we had a better ball club. We know we're not supposed to lose that game. Um, you know, it is, <clears throat> it's a tough one, you know, for sure. Um, just because this team, you know, was struggling and, and you know, the, the way we had to lead, um, you know, we were 41-19. Um, and this is a, you know, a, not just a game, but, you know, the next couple games where we play, we get a rhythm against, you know, teams that are um, in the bottom half of the league, I guess, you know. Um, and we're supposed to win this one, but uh, this one, I think it's one that we uh, just flush it. You know, we all know what we're supposed to do, um, you know, from an individual standpoint and as a team standpoint. And we move on, get ready for Friday. That's how I think it, it, it should be handled, but um, then we have all tomorrow according to the rules and come in Friday and, and kind of shoot around or whatever the plan is and get ready for, you know, our opponent Friday and, and take all that frustration and, you know, read it while we off the game, and, you know, out on it. Um, are there any moments where before it got to down to the final couple minutes where you, you feel like it was a juncture where, where you guys could have taken back control? I mean, the, the Back to back threes with Avery come to mind, or I'm not sure if there are any other points in the game where you thought maybe it could have turned. Um, I mean, it could really turn at any point. Momentum, I mean, a shot that could have went in. I mean, I don't know, Bell had great looks, missed them. Base had a good looking corner, you made two and missed that one. So, I mean, it's a lot of looks that. You know, we, we wish they could have went in, but that's not even, you know, the while we lost the game. It was one of the deepest events. We had 37 and 41 point quarter. Um, and we didn't score in the fourth quarter. So, I mean, that's another reason why. But, you know, we were 19 in the first, then 37 and 41. It's so only very unacceptable for our defense. And we would be better than that. So, um, don't worry about the offense. You know, we've been a team that's been. <laughs> In the middle of the pack or below all year on defense, and we have to get better at that for you. 
Um, you guys have mentioned this kind of being an adjustment period. Do you feel like this is kind of just one of the lumps you got to take early in the season? Or? No, this ain't no adjustment period at all. Not this game. That's just straight on, on us. It's not you know, other games possible, but this is an adjustment game where, you know, I feel like it's, oh, we're still learning each other. We're still not this game. What do you feel about your return to Oklahoma City and Laker uniform and just how the fans uh, reacted to you to you out there on the floor again? Um, you know, like I said yesterday, people have always been great to me and my family. And, um, you know, they're always very welcoming. Um, just unfortunately, you know, we didn't win. The rest of the Pokemon follow. Uh, you know, three of the games so far this season, your turn over. Total is pretty low uh, tonight in Memphis. Who was higher? Is there anything you can pinpoint? What's no, I just mean I gotta take it a ball. Simple, just making plays and trying to make lobs and too many mishaps on my on my on my, on my part. So this just, just on me, but I'm gonna take care of it. I know that and keep the game simple um, because we we need those possessions, especially. Games like this. Thanks, fellas.